Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. So today in this lecture, we will discuss about chains, branches and rings. Okay students, so first we will discuss about the chains of carbon atoms. Chains of carbon atoms. So I will give you some examples how the chains of carbon atoms are formed. So let us take the example of ethane C2H6. So it is called as ethane and the molecular diagram of this is. So student it is a chain structure in which the two carbon atoms are in the chain. Okay let us let me give you one more example like pentane the formula for this is C5 H12 okay so for alkane let me write alkanes the general formula is cn h2n plus 2 okay which is in the case if it is pentane means carbon is 5 so if you put n equal 5 so it will give you c5h12 okay so here are five carbon atoms that are arranged in chains okay So this is a structural diagram of pentane. So these are all in chains. Okay. So now let's discuss about branches. So students, now we will see the, that the various branches. So as you know, the formula for butane is C4H10. So this can be drawn like this only. This also. Okay means C four carbon atoms are arranged in a chain but there can also be a structure which is like this so there should be four bonds of carbon that should be completed okay so these three four three seven and three ten so it is also C four H ten and the name of these two are called as structural isomers means having same formula but different structure okay so these are all in branches okay so this is the one example of branches students okay so now we will discuss about the next is the ring structure okay so student the ring structure is let me discuss the very famous example of benzene it is C6H6 benzene okay so how I am arranging the all the six carbon atoms so they are alternate single and double bonds in the carbon okay so already there are three bonds so to complete the octet so it uh, make a form a uh, bond with one hydrogen atom so it is C6H6 which forms a ring like structure okay so it is benzene in which there is alternate single and double bond is there okay so all these carbon compounds which contains carbon and hydrogen all the carbon compounds which contain just carbon and hydrogen are called hydrocarbons okay student so if uh, anybody asks you that what is uh, hydrocarbons so that then you will write this definition and as I have told you that alkane 
alkene is are those hydrocarbons which have in formula cn h2n plus 2 now alkene is cn h2n okay and in alkyne alkyne it is cnhn okay so these are unsaturated because they have double and triple bonds and this is saturated okay carbon compounds so that we have discussed in the previous lecture also okay so now i hope that you are pretty clear about what we have discussed so far in this lecture and if you have still any doubt or any question based on this then please students uh, do comment in the comment section in the next lecture we will discuss about homologous series okay so stay tuned for the next lecture on homologous series